Okay guys, today's test drive is gonna be on a 1964 Ford Falcon. This one here has a, uh, believe to be 427. It's got the big block under the hood. This is a very strong motor built. You'll be able to uh, see that in the middle of the test drive here. It's a fast car, side pipes, cutouts, disc brakes in the front, drum in the rear, sticker kit, beautiful paint job. Roll cage, a lot of upgrades. Look below in the description, I put all kinds of uh, information on this car. And you can also check us out at maplemotors.com. I have shipping and financing available. Plus there's like 100 detailed pictures on there for you to check out, along with all of our inventory. This one's got an electric fan set up on it as well, which is gonna be needed on this one. I'm pretty excited. This should be a great test drive. I tell you what, Go ahead, hit subscribe, share this video. That helps me out quite a bit. And uh, I'll keep these videos running your way for now. It's about that time. Let's go for a ride. Before we take off, place your bets. Do you think the horn works? This one's got a reverse manual valve body, transmission setup. It's gonna be a sweet ride. It's gonna be really fast. We're not gonna be able to go too far because the exhaust is extremely loud and the police department is literally on top of the hill there i could see us getting pulled over from this thing just check it out we're gonna go ahead this is a fuel pump electric fan switch give her a little bit more gas electronic cutouts it's not really too much of a difference a little bit quieter when you push down cut them on it smells like racing fuel Also do a walk around on this one. I'll be back in just a moment. Okay, so I ran in and got a different mount because the other one that I had needed need to be tightened up for this ride. That's for sure. Like I said, fuel pump, electric fans. Engine temperature's coming up. Looks like it's at 170 now.
brakes on this thing. Stuff pretty fast. A bit too putting it. But it seems to be holding its own. Engine temperature is below 180. Okay, engine temperature's doing great on this one. It's staying steady at 180.
Hopefully they scoot up for me to get around here. Come on, Mercedes. steering on it and a lot of times when there's no power steering there's a little bit of slack we've got great temperature and oil pressure let's get these outside shots okay back here at the lot on the 64 falcon this one's got aluminum heads under the hood She's extremely powerful. I was impressed. I enjoyed the test drive too. It's got aluminum radiator, electric fans. Sweet paint job. I like the sticker kit. It's looking mean on here. It's got a fuel cell in the trunk, roll cage, cutouts. The battery's been relocated back here. Well, a nice cage. This thing is cool. I definitely enjoyed the test drive. I was laughing pretty much the whole time. Let's get started here. So we're gonna look around this car. They painted the bumpers on it. Um, and we're gonna get down low and look for chip scratches, issues you would need to know about. Definitely look at my detailed pictures because it's a second view from a different person, different perspective. I do the videos, he does the pictures. Just go to maplemotors.com, check that out. Of course, all of our inventory is there as well. There's a light scratch here on the front bumper. Coming down the lower portion here. Everything looks really nice and clean. I'm not really seeing too many imperfections. Tiny chip down here. You've got a chip back here as well. You got a couple little bubbles popping up there. And a couple little cracks in the back here. A little bit of pitting on some of your trim. Coming back to this midsection. Nice and clean, straight. On top of the fender here, you have a chip that's been touched up. Front windshield, there's a light scratch here that comes up. A little bit of pitting on your door handle there. And your mirror, or not your mirror, your um, vent window trim. Most of the other trim looks pretty good. Coming around the back. Fiberglass bumpers. Done a lot of different things on this car to make it lighter. Trunk's still metal. Just double checking, because the hood is not. Got some dings in the back trim. 
kill switch in the back. Scratch air fuel cell. Roll cage ran to the back to make it right. I'm gonna hold the car together. <laughs> Weather stripping's nice. Trunk lid's nice. And keys are in the ignition so I can shut her down. Couple little spots there in the back. And it shuts easy. Let's go down this side now. Shooting down the lower portion. Little spot in the corner there. Got a couple chips in the edge of the door. Got a little chip at the bottom there. Fiberglass bumper in the front as well. A couple chips up here. Down the midsection. Chip beside your keyhole. A little ding in the trim. And over the back. Small hole there from where the mirror was. We got some bug screens on here, fiberglass hood. Let's go ahead and check that interior out. Door panel on this one down at the bottom. Not quite perfect. People kicking the door as they're getting out of the car there. See it's kind of pulled there as well and a little wavy. Weather stripping on this is not bad shape. Looks decent. bottom of the door checking your jams interior used to be blue at least this trim piece did carpet in this one's not in bad shape the seat looks great it's in great shape they've re definitely replaced the carpet the package tray door panels look good in the back too headliner and it looks good. Coming across the dash here. Give you a good look, see? <laughs> we'll slide in here. The roll bar is actually in a perfect spot. You just kind of lay on it and fall in. So that works out. Glove box is in good shape. delete plate there that's your cutout switch doesn't really change a whole lot but it definitely does it's just uh not really any quieter <laughs> got a little bit of pitting popping up on some of your interior trim and of course on this one feel the pump up and turn the key bumper twice Give her another lift. 
person. That's open. Now you can hear the thunder. Super loud. I'll leave it open because y'all haven't heard it walking around with them open yet. enjoyed this video if you did hit subscribe share that helps me out more than you know also hit like and I'll keep these videos coming your way thank you for watching I'll see you later